hey guys welcome back to my channel today i'm doing a walmart clothing haul i figured everyone needs a little break from christmas shopping and i picked some really cute stuff so i wanted to share it with you if you like these kind of videos make sure you give it a thumbs up subscribe if you're new and let's get on with the haul the first thing i picked up is this cardigan from no boundaries it's just a duster long super cozy piece it has a hood there's pockets on the front just really comfortable soft really stretchy it's this eyelash kind of material i love the colors in it it's like pastels pretty yellows purples blues light and bright and i thought it was going to be perfect to bring me way into spring with these pretty colors so i did size up to a large in it you can if you want but i just wanted it to be more cozy more oversized 16 dollars and change it does come in a black really nice neutral you can't go wrong with it with leggings with jeans and then it also comes in a gray which is also i think all three you can't really go wrong with but i wanted something unique something like pretty i feel like i go towards black a lot so i wanted to get something different but i kind of want to go back and get the black too just because it's so good the next thing i picked up to go with that cardigan are these pants from secret treasures they're a plush velour like really cozy material jogger pan i did get my normal size medium they're 12 dollars and change they're so soft like really like butter and plushy and i really don't think you go wrong with the price it does have a matching top i didn't get it i'm thinking about it i'm kind of going towards yes just because you i mean it's always good to have the set um this is considered to be pajamas i think it might be a lounge outfit so I just thought it would be really cute with that cardigan. It's just easy to be home, run and get the girls if I need to, and um, just really comfortable. And I think that's the best thing to have right now is just easy outfits for me. The next thing I picked up is by the brand Secret Treasures. It's a, it's supposed to be a lounge piece to wear with the joggers that go with it, but I got it as like a coat or a sweatshirt or cardigan. So it's just, it, it's an open front. There's a hood and pockets. Super plush. It's supposed to be, it's like faux Sherpa. But this color last year was on a lot of boutique pullovers that gray with the light on the top. And they were like $40 and $50. This was between $10 and $12 and change. So I think it was around $12. But it, I could be wrong. It could have been $10. Um, I did size down to a small. This comes in a bunch of different colors. So black, ivory, I think pinks. There's so many colors and everything. Um, just easy. If you want to wear it as like a robe style top as well, you could do that. But I'm going to be wearing it as like an everyday lettering piece. I don't really wear coats here too much in Florida. So I thought that was perfect to throw on when it's cold in the morning. And then these things, I've, I've been loving these. Every time I go there, my eyes go to these tank tops or camisoles, whatever you call it. But they're from the brand No Boundaries. When I saw this one, I had to have it. Um, just the rainbow colors. This comes in solid reds, blacks, pink, gold, white with silver. And they have a bunch of different styles now too, like a high neck kind of halter style. This one that has a little detailing on the back and then a peplum and with the holidays you can't go wrong you don't want to spend a lot of money on something like this that you're not going to wear too much you can really dress these up or down um to be like festive for the holiday you could wear the red one with jeans and a cardigan or like a red cardigan and the red or the black with the black pants i'm going to show it would be really cute um if you're like going out it was very new york to me like the black sequins with the black pants and you could throw like a blazer over this and really like make it more evening wear or a velvet blazer would be really cute so you can really do a lot with these and they're so inexpensive this was 11.96 um like how do they even do this like all these sequins and the fabric for 11 and change i did get my normal size medium in this i think these do run a little big i don't know i haven't tried this on yet 
So it, I could usually tell by hanging something up if it's gonna fit me or not. And this, the medium looked like it was gonna fit me and I am a true medium. So normally no boundaries I size up, but I don't think you need to in this one, but I won't know for sure. I'll let you guys know in the, in the comments down below if I think you should sign up, size up with that. And then to go with the sequin top, I got these coated jeans. These are from No Boundaries. I size up two, so I size up to an 11 just because I held them up in the store and they look really, really small. And then I also read the reviews and people pretty much said size up two. So these are $14.98. I don't think you could go wrong with that price for a coated denim. This also comes in a camo there's jeans there's corduroys so lots of different options look really high waisted you could tell they're super high waisted i think this is going to look so good with that rainbow sequin tank top you can also get like all black if you want to do an all black look with this and then a blazer that would look so expensive i would never think that that outfit is under 25 dollars but just really easy and for that price, you don't care if you want them once or twice. It's not that big of a deal. And the last thing I picked up are a pair of jeans. They're by the brand Celebrity Pink. And I did size up to a 29. I wouldn't recommend it. I'm normally a 28, and I would say definitely get your true size. So they come in a bunch of different colors. There's a, a darker denim, a black, and then one other color. I can't think of it right now. It might be like a mid-tone. So there is rips in the knees. They reminded me on the website of the Free People Busted Knee Jeans, but just a little, like a little more modest, not showing your whole knee. They're like $17 and change. These feel like really nice quality. Very similar to, to the Sophia jeans, if you've ever tried hers. They really feel like that. They, they're better quality, I think, than the No Boundaries, and their sizing is probably a little better too just from holding these up these feel like they are true 29s i don't think i have celebrity pink jeans but i'm pretty sure they are like a better brand of jean and for 17 dollars, i don't think that's bad i might pick them up in the black too they are like a shorter length as well they're like raw hemmed and i think they are shorter but i like shorter jeans i kind of like that little ankle kind of show showing um I have shorter legs. I'm not short, but I, I'm like 5'6", but I do have shorter legs. So I don't like crop jeans, but I like a little bit of ankle. I'm not sure if that's good or bad, if it makes me look short or not, but I don't care. I just really, really like that style. So I'm super happy with these. I might exchange them for the 28th, so I'm not sure, but I really like those. Thank you so much for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it, and don't forget to subscribe. Bye.